When we make our incision, we always have to probe the apical soft tissue. Noi dobbiamo sempre sondare il tessuto molle apicale. From the palatine side and leave one millimeter of adherent gingiva, which means beyond probing, leave one millimeter more gingiva, palatine flap, because the one that has to give me vascular supply has a connective graft that will only be partially covered by the palatine flap, because there is no possibility of coronal displacement of the palatine flap. So the envelope is a mesial thickness surgical papilla and a distal thickness surgical papilla, partial thickness mesial distal. All of the periosteum apical to the palatine recession has to be maintained, so I recommend we never use the periosteal elevator in the palatine flap. We do all our root smoothing procedures, application of EDTA.